The term Red-Green-Brown Alliance, originating in France, refers to the alliance of leftists red, ecologically minded agrarians green, and Islamists brown. The term has also been used to describe alleged alliances of industrial union focused leftists red, ecologically minded agrarians green, and nationalists brown. It is often used in a broad sense to refer to anti-Semitic, conservationist, anti-globalization, anti-American, or anti-Western views shared by disparate groups and movements. Topic. History The earliest attempt for such an alliance was during the guided democracy in Indonesia. President Sukarno, to please the three dominant powers of Indonesia at the time, the army, the religious groups and the PKI, proposes a concept called Nasakam from nationalisma, agama, komunisma, nationalism, religion, communism, which was meant to unite the three opposing powers to support the Indonesian Socialist Revolution. This, however, was condemned by mainstream Islamic groups such as Nadlatul Ulama in the pretext that Islam cannot coexist with communism. The Nasakam concept faded from popularity as the new order came into power. French essayist Alexandre Del Valle wrote of Une alliance idéologique. Rouge brun vert. A red-green-brown ideological alliance in a the 22nd of April 2002 article in the newspaper Le Figaro, and wrote, Rouge's Bruns Verts, L'Etrange Alliance, in a January 2004 article in the magazine Politique Internationale, Del Valle's conceptual rendering of Islamist ideological trends appears to be based, at least partially, on earlier writings in which he had charged the United States and Western Europe with favoring the war machine of armed Islamism. Via its funding of the Afghani Mujahideen during the Soviet-Afghan War during the presidency of Ronald Reagan, which helped future enemies of the West. In 2010, Del Valle published in Italy an essay entitled, Rossi, Neri, Verdi, a Convergenza degli Estremi Aposti. Red, Black. Green, the meeting of extreme opposites, the later popularity of the red-green-brown theory and its various permutations derives mainly from a speech given by Roger Kukierman, president of the French Jewish organization CRIF, to a CRIF banquet on 25 January 2003, and given wide circulation by a 27-28 January 2003 article in Le Monde. Kukierman used the French term Alliance Brun Vert Rouge to describe the anti-Semitic alignment supposedly shared by an extreme right nostalgic for racial hierarchies, symbolized by the color brown, an extreme left, which is anti-globalist, anti-capitalist, anti-American, and anti-Zionist. Red, and followers of José Bové, Green. In Great Britain in 2003, politician George Galloway announced that he was seeking to unify the red, green, anti-war, Muslim and other social constituencies radicalized by the war. Shortly thereafter, led by Salma Yaqub and George Monbiot, the Socialist Workers' Party and the Muslim Association of Britain formed an alliance in the Respect Party, under which Galloway ran for office. Respect initially tried to form an electoral pact with the Green Party of England and Wales, 407 to 408, but the Green Party refused to ally with Respect, saying that Respect did not align with their values of openness and democracy and had an underdeveloped political platform among other issues. In the United States, a similar alliance of disparate groups occurred in opposition to the World Trade Organization in the Alter Globalization Movement 
movement, which joined trade unions, neo-Luddite environmentalists, and paleoconservative nationalists like Pat Buchanan in common cause. Many were surprised by leftist Lenora Fulani's support for Pat Buchanan, which has been viewed as an example of a red-green-brown alliance. <laughs> See also